U-Move is a system for full body movement training using an augmented reality mirror. The U-Move system takes inspiration from the typical floor-to-ceiling mirrors found in ballet studios and is comprised of a half-silvered mirror projection screen. The glass projection screen was built by placing a diffuse film on one side and a half-silvered mirror film on the other. A Microsoft Connect tracks the user's movements, allowing a rear projector to overlay content on the user's reflection. This multiplex display allows trainees to see their own reflection as well as virtual content. By changing the lighting conditions, the trainee's focus can be shifted between the reflection and the projected content. Using a servo motor mounted to a dimmer switch, U-Move can automatically control the ambient lighting. Users interact with the mirror display interface components using the reflection of their hand. U-Move is comprised of a simple software tool to record the movements and a corresponding training system for instruction. The recording tool captures the movements of authors and uses those as a template. Authors can specify keyframes to highlight critical points in the movement and mark the most relevant joints within those keyframes. The author can also record video clips to add domain-specific knowledge that cannot be captured in the movement and specify parameters such as stability, timing, smoothness, or precision that can be used to guide training. A user begins by selecting a movement that they wish to learn. Alternatively, users can search the gallery of movements by demonstration, performing a posture that occurs within the desired movement. The system compares the user's posture to those in the database and presents the most likely matches. The user can then select the desired movement from the updated gallery. Once a movement is selected, the training is separated into stages. The user begins training in a demonstration stage where they can watch a video of the movement. While the video plays, the keyframes are audibly counted off, helping the user learn timing. After completing the demonstration, the posture guide is unlocked. The posture guide encourages users to align their reflection with the skeleton projected on the mirror and hold that position stable. Errors in positioning are indicated by red circles. If large errors in depth are present, a callout showing a side view appears to help the user correct their posture. After each stage, trainees can review their performance on each of the keyframes using the feedback screen. This screen shows the user's score, a video of their performance, the trainer's performance, along with the corresponding skeletons. By walking left and right, trainees can change the viewpoint of the rendered skeletons, which let them compare their performance to the trainers. Context buttons allow the user to navigate between keyframes, repeat the stage, or advance to the next stage. If the keyframe has an annotation, the user can play it back using the context button. Here, the trainer has indicated that pointing the foot is important. Following the posture guide, the movement guide renders the movement without pausing at keyframes, providing the user with a better sense of timing and less guidance on positioning. 3D ribbons emitting from the hands and feet cue upcoming movements. Here we see it from the user's perspective. After the movement guide is the mirror guide. The mirror guide removes all visual feedback and the trainee is forced to perform the movement relying only on the learned movement, their reflection, and audio cues. Following the mirror guide is the on your own guide. In this guide, trainees have no feedback or timing information, mimicking a real-world performance scenario. U-Move uses a skeletal matching algorithm, so the body shape and size of the trainee does not need to match the author. Here we see a child recording a movement. The child's skeleton is transformed so that it can be properly overlaid and guide the adult user, despite their significant height and size difference. An evaluation was conducted comparing U-Move to a video-only learning scenario. Retention tests showed significantly more learning with the U-Move system and an overall positive response to the system. 